Hey, what's up? It's Bart. What a beautiful way to start a new week, yeah? It's Monday morning and I just took you into the wild. I thought that it will be silence here, but all those noises, some frogs, birds, I took you into the nature because I would like to show you the one piece of gear that I just bought last week because I was on some kind of expo organized in Krakow which I will show you in the while and I will show you what I just bought after that expo that the event was very good. I looked for some gear that I want to buy. Actually, it will be a gimbal, which is, I think, required for me to make some interesting and stable videos as I'm planning to deploy my skills and also make some interesting movies for you. I walked through the presentation of all companies and I found the gimbal which is interesting for me and also I found some very good third-party lenses for my main setup 
for my Fujifilm XS10. I hope that I will be able to afford them during the next few months because I'm also starting the studio build out so you know costs 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 but we have to also have some money for the living so not only gear matters as I mentioned previously Okay, actually I changed my mind and decided to take you to the canoe track which is located in the south west of Krakow next to the Vistula river and there should be some table when I can you know open the gimbal and try to balance it properly this is actually the full-size canoe track and some kind of international canoe championship took place right here in Krakow and I think that every year there is some kind of national and international championship organized here so quite a famous place if you are canoe fan I'm not actually, but nice to have such a place in your city. And actually, if you want to visit this place, it's like eight kilometers from the city center. So you just have to take a bus if you're in Krakow without your car. And you can get here easily. I will sit here and just show you what's in the box because I bought a basic set for this gimbal you have the gimbal itself which is very small and lightweight but it can handle small mirrorless camera action cam which I also have and I'm recording on this right now and the mirrorless full frame cameras like Sony a7 S3 with the small lens of course so what you have more in this setup there is of course some small tripod which you can easily mount on the bottom and even with this tripod this gimbal is actually very small and lightweight so you can use it like one hand and with two hands there is a mounting screw quick release plate some cables to charge the gimbal and some gels because you have the small built-in light in this gimbal which can be used in some uh, low light situations this is not a big light but you know when you do not have anything else you can use it and it will work it is just plain white light so if you want to change the mood you can just put the magnetic gel on it and it will change the mood and the gimbal itself pros and cons the pros for sure the lightweight the lock mechanism which is actually applied for each axis you can easily lock all the axes and you can transport this gimbal actually in your backpack how to balance this gimbal I will show you in the next location so let's go with me I hope to make a lot of better videos with this gimbal mm -hmm. 